Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's vlog, I'm starting off a little bit different. Bear with me. Um, let's have some fun. I'm going to do my makeup starting off with my uh, L'Oreal True Match foundation. I'm not going to do a concealer today. It's just a light, easy on the go makeup that I'm trying. Now I'm going to use my NARS palette to do a light contour and blush. And this is a e.l.f. cosmetic contour brush that I absolutely adore. All right, very simple, soft, let's go. Next thing is using this Opalescent Ethereal uh, BH Cosmetic Eyeshadow Palette. And I'm going to do a soft brown look today. We're going in with Stunner right there using the blending brush end of my Luxe Eyeshadow Brush. Now we're going to go in with Star. It's like a champagne shimmer, light shimmery touch to my lid. We're going to tap it in there gently and lightly to make sure that I have full coverage but just not doing too much today but look at that oh my god it's already coming along love it now we're gonna go uh, to define our eyebrows with flutter as you see here I'm going in gently boom 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 that's right and after that I'm going in with my mascara guys this is Maybelline the Colossal it's waterproof Definitely waterproof. This stuff is so hard to remove at the end of the night, um, but it's so worth it. Especially if it's going to rain today. I don't want it all over my face. Let's get it, girl. Um, what else? What else? So I'm making sure this is all full coverage. And next thing is the eyebrows. Super important. This is a Wet n Wild um, eyebrow pen. I love that it's double-sided because it has the eyebrow brush. And then on the other side, it has the brow pencil. And now some brown lipstick to match my eyes. Love it. All right, guys. So I'm upstairs in my bathroom. I just, I did my makeup in the living room table. I didn't feel like doing it upstairs for some reason. And I have not been feeling well at all. I was feeling so sick yesterday. I feel a little bit better today, but I'm still a little bit under the weather. Um, just trying to like umph myself up and... Like just energize myself and try to feel better and do my makeup. So I did a really light makeup. This isn't like my full makeup that I do. Um, as you see, I didn't really use concealer. I didn't do my eyeliner or anything like that. I don't always use concealer or do my eyeliner every day. This is just simple everyday light makeup. So there you go. Don't come at me for not using concealer. Um, but yeah, it's just something simple and light so that I could have my face on and go out and it's easier to remove at the end of the night anyways <laughs> so yeah so this is it guys I'm gonna get ready and we're gonna go out do something and I hope to feel better I'm really trying guys I've been at a down I'm just being very real I've just been in not in the highest spirits lately i don't know what's wrong with me i'm meh that's that's how i've been feeling but i have to think like okay narita get yourself up again come on like i'm sick i'm feeling down at the same time it's just a whole whirlwind of things going on and emotions and s anyways thinking of good things thinking of just what is to come, being optimistic, trying to have fun and living the fun life. a day that I'm embracing being by myself and just enjoying the day and just taking in the fresh air. I was at Winter Park, Florida and um, I know it may sound random but I got some uh, Christmas cards for some friends that I know still appreciate Christmas cards at like Rifle Co. It's like Rifle Paper and Co. It's like a cute um, like paper 
store that they have like cards and posters and postcards and pens like things like that um like stationary things it's so cute i love it so i went there and then i went to starbucks to charge my phone <laughs> and get some coffee because it started raining a lot so it just started raining a lot so i left the area um not much there to to do so especially a day like today it's rainy and it's um veterans day so not a lot is open which is fine um i'm just enjoying being alone sometimes you have to learn um how to enjoy being alone and just embracing the day um just as it comes because sometimes in life you you may be alone you may not always be surrounded by people and i genuinely enjoy it um i love going out with my husband and i love going out with my friends but there are some days it's here and there it's rare but i have some days that i'm just like on my own and i'm totally fine with that um then i found a plaza i don't mean to ramble on but guys i found a plaza and this plaza is dangerous because there is a ross a michaels and a marshall's all next to each other dangerous like very dangerous for me <laughs> i think i'm gonna do some shopping um i'm not gonna go crazy shopping i'm still like very conscious about that but i am looking for some shirts um i need shirts to like uh be able to go out i have a lot of like work attire and i don't really have clothes to like um go out especially now that you know i'm still working from home and now i'm starting to go out more often i don't just have like regular clothes i don't have a big selection of just regular clothes that's not work attire so i'm looking for that but i'm not trying to go crazy shopping but i'm being tempted right now because michael's is there and it's like the holiday season and i haven't like bought no nothing for christmas yet I'm behind this year. I'm behind, guys. I didn't even decorate for fall. What's wrong with me? I don't know. I'm not trying to let, like, 2020, like, just damper my mind about the holidays. Like, I still think, and I've spoke about this previously in the vlog, that I think it's still a good time. Like, we, we could still have a chance at making 2020 a good year, although there's, like, a month and a half left of the year. But, guys, let's make the best out of it, okay? So, let's do some shopping. I got to put my mask on now. Okay. <laughs> guys so i went to marshall's here now marshall's and home goods is together so there's still two separate signs outside let me take this off so there's still two separate signs for home goods and marshall's but the store is basically linked up together so i got a few things at marshall's a few things at home goods and now i'm gonna hit up ross really quick and when i get home i'll show you guys what i got i'll do a look like a Call for you guys. Mmm, what a day. I am done shopping. Like, done. I'm trying to be careful. But I got a few items I'm going to show you guys when I get home. Because I just remembered that I'm actually pretty far from my house. Um, Yeah, I kind of like this. I needed to, like, get away and get some fresh air. Because, guys, let me tell you. It's been a week and like I said, I wasn't feeling well and I was just going through so much. So I'm glad that I lost myself enough to forget kind of where I am. I, I know where I'm at, but I don't know if you can relate where you're out all day or you're just like, like zoomed out into like what you're doing and it kind of like relieves your mind so much that you kind of lose sense of time or sense of like, where you are in a good way and that's what happened to me i was at ross that was my like final stop i'm not gonna go into michael's that'll be next time um and i suddenly remember like 
oh shoot i'm not at my ross like there's a ross near my house and i'm like oh my god i'm still in winter park I, that's like almost like an hour from my home and it's getting late i was like oh my god i'm like an hour away i just remembered so i need to leave like right now and get to the house and go see shaheen and chloe and charlie and of course i got something for them and i got some stuff for the upcoming vlogs for vlogmas yay we are gonna do vlogmas i was i was contemplating it guys i wasn't sure if i was gonna do vlogmas this year because let me tell you it is it's a lot i enjoy it okay but it's so much and kind of like a lot of pressure to vlog every single day straight like 25 days straight in a row and be able to edit it to have it like posted every single day consistently it's a lot of work it's a lot of pressure <laughs> but we're gonna make it happen for you guys i'm gonna challenge myself to do vlogmas to post every day for those 25 days and yeah guys to so stay consistent with the monday wednesday friday remember that's new that's gonna start next week um so we will be posting monday wednesday friday tune in and also we're, we're trying to evolve people we're trying to like do it if you have any suggestions if you have any ideas for upcoming videos or anything that you would like to see from us please comment below sometimes people don't comment below let us know um suggestions comments questions concerns ideas or or a video that you would really like to see from us or any questions you have to us feel free to comment below let's get home and i'm going to show you guys what i bought but um so i want to give you guys a haul of the things that i purchased i don't think i mentioned it earlier but i also stopped by five and below guys guys i love five below okay i don't care what no one says i have no shame in my game i like like name brand stores but at the same time i also don't mind finding a deal or a sale or something good on a budget like hey i'm all for it and if i could find a good steal for five or less let's do it i have no shame in my game and i found some awesome dog stuff today and as of lately too at five and below and i'm like this is so cute guys they have a whole dog set a uh, pet section dogs and cats beds for five bucks uh clothes for less than five bucks to five bucks like dang like even at ross sometimes the dog clothes is like more expensive um they have like good stuff too for pets but anyways back to the point so this is what i got for <sighs> i went crazy at five and below guys i went crazy because i have some uh video ideas for vlogmas and um so i also got some other things and i'm getting things together for that so first one is this one for charlie now in the previous shopping vlog you guys see that i got this for chloe um and charlie but charlie's didn't fit so i got his in his size today so that it fits and the other one i'm gonna go exchange or return it um and i spoke to the guy about it and he was like yeah that i, I still had time to do that um which is that's a great return policy they're not gonna be like oh, only seven days or 30 days i could still go and take it he hasn't been able to wear it so this one he'll be able to wear it. it's his size perfect isn't it so cute but with this guys i know i'm not trying to sound cheesy or anything but they have matching pajamas for us. Shaheen's gonna probably kill me. I'm gonna make him wear it. Oh well, like this is a family unit. We're gonna match. I'm all for the matching. And I love sometimes Shaheen and I, before we leave somewhere, we end up matching without planning it. And I'm like, I'm like, oh my God, like we're like in sync. But then if I see things that we can match, like this just happened today. What a coincidence, the pajama pants for adults, the same as, look at this, I'm mind blown. So I got one for me and one for Shaheen. And then see, ah, okay. So that's that, uh, Charlie's pajama. And then look how cute guys for Chloe. I got her this like sweater and skirt outfit. And then I got Charlie a sweater a christmas sweater isn't this adorable look at that their little like tail and pee hole and then they have like um 
a hole here so that the collar can come out on some of them not all of them but yeah super cute and then i got chloe look at this isn't this adorable um i have my oh my god i gotta show it to you guys um my ugly sweater the hat is actually the christmas tree and it has these um pom-pom balls in it as the ornaments so when i saw this i thought of it and i'm like oh my gosh we're gonna match um they didn't have this is actually charlie's for charlie's size i'm gonna go look for a small one at another fed below so it could be chloe's size so it could fit her so that's that so that's All right, next thing I saw that I like is a gingerbread house. You know, there's gingerbread house, but a Hershey chocolate house to build with Shaheen. And that'll be during Vlogmas. You guys can see us. We'll do like a Q&A or chat while building that. I don't want to give it all away though. So that's all I'm going to tell you. But yes, I got this Hershey house. They have like other flavors like ginger and... Hershey and like different designs. Now let's go to Home Goods. All right, at Home Goods, I got two satin uh, pillowcases for $7.99. I'm gonna change our pillow pillows cases to these. Ours are cotton. I used to have satin ones. They're much better for your face and they're much better for your hair. It prevents um prevents knots when you use satin in comparison to a cotton or polyester pillow and a cotton or polyester pillow case absorbs in more and like it retains it but not a satin one and it helps prevent um your face being marked like if have you ever like slept on one side like the whole night and like your face is marked that can over a period of time cause like fine lines and wrinkles um also if you get hot or so in the night like that can you know mess up your face basically or your skin um especially people with really sensitive skin like both shaheen and i have both sensitive skin satin a uh, pillowcase are a lifesaver I'm so sorry. guys i'm trying to record for the fine damn stop sorry that that was really hey i apologize for that all right so there we go all right, now moving on to Marshalls, I got face mask. I love these. I'm a little picky with face mask, but Shaheen and I love using face mask. Oh my God, he's gonna kill me for saying that. I love face mask and Shaheen has grown to enjoy face mask with me. I put face mask on him. I, you know, I pamper him here and there, okay? You gotta pamper your man too. Um, And take, I'd like to take care of like his skin and my skin, so, I saw these and I was like, these are good. Rose and Collagen Hydrating Face Masks for moisturizing, toning, and wrinkle reducing. Guys, I'm almost 30, so this is gonna like, I need this. <laughs> Anyways, so um, this brings five masks and it was under five bucks. Yeah, five dollars at uh, Marshall's, so it's really good. And another thing, I needed this for my uh, face uh, cleansing routine is a uh, eco facial like a like a facial brush cleansing brush and this is it and i'm gonna i like this one because um it's eco it looks more like um more like natural and i like things that look like chic and classy or like fancy but then also like things that look very like eco-friendly and natural so in the previous clip when i was at um marshall's you saw that i took one that was like in gold but then i saw this one and i'm like it looks so natural and i so i just took this one instead but anyways so you see it has the soft um microfiber sponge here and then the exfoliating part in the back and it's very gentle and soft and i got one that was very uh gentle especially the exfoliating part because i have sensitive skin and it's not for scrubbing harsh don't be harsh on your skin be gentle on your skin but this is good when you put your cleanser on that's not an exfoliator it's two different types of cleansers your regular cleanser and you have that on your skin you uh you know when you're foaming it or or doing um circulating it around your face you could use this tool and it helps get in there and clean your pores and remove blackheads and all that <coughs> stuff and the third and final thing that i got at marshall's was these travel bottles i saw these and i'm like yes thank god i didn't have to 
order it online and wait for it to arrive. Shaheen and I have a tentative trip coming up. And I've used like the plastic um, reusable bottles. Like I found that like Dollar Tree and it was perfect because I got a pack of like three for a dollar literally. And they were the size that's required in the airport. Or even if you're not traveling by plane and you just want to reduce the space in your luggage, um, this is perfect fine it's like use the travel size right but those started to like leak out oh my god and in my last trip it leaked out leaked out um from the bottle just a little bit and if anything presses on it and it cracks it's gonna spill all over your luggage so it was not an, it affected for me it was just gonna cause more of a problem um so in this case i like these silicone bottles because they're squishy you can't really break it unless you really try to break it but you can break these and it's a uh, open cap and you squeeze it out you seal it and you don't worry about this really bursting into your luggage and i got two of these for how much was it 4.99 not bad but it will splurge but like not bad really for for two of these and it's gonna last me and i'm gonna use it it's gonna be it's really effective i needed this so that's what I got from both Marshalls and Home Goods, and then you saw what I got if I below. Now let's go to Ross. So Ross now. So I like I told you earlier, um, I didn't wasn't gonna get too many things at Ross. I just needed like a few shirts because I have mostly like uh, business wear, work wear, and um i don't mind repeating the same clothes over and over again. Like I'm a frugal diva. Like I'm a, I'm frugal. Uh, baller on the budget type of person you know i'm just saying however um now that everything's like more from home and uh florida hit phase three we're starting to go out more i'm like dang i need shirts or just like regular shirts you know like sometimes you just need a variety of clothes uh clothes that i could just pop on and leave um so i got a few things at ross not too much so that's really what the focus was I still need like maybe two to three I, I alternate really and I'm not trying to spend so much money like um it's November the holidays are approaching so yeah I need to save for what's coming so I got just a regular shirt I saw this I'm like this isn't bad at all it's a loose t-shirt so I got another t-shirt this is like for anything like you know daily like a vlog where i go out or i just have errands to do i could pop on this shirt and it's versatile i could use it over uh some jeans or tuck it in in like my high-waisted jeans um or wear it with leggings really however or with some biker shorts perfect comfortable shirt right here and guys this um was under seven dollars so look at that all, everything I got at Ross today was like under $10. I love it. So that's that, right? That's more like comfortable, casual. But then I got this long sleeve. It's going to be getting cold in Florida soon, hopefully. Um, and this is a thin, like very thin, still fresh, but still like, you know, long sleeve if it was to get more chilly here. Um, and it's this long sleeve shirt and it goes up to the neck like up to here almost and it's a bit fitting but still loose and comfortable and same you could wear it with jeans i could wear it with like a um, high-waisted jean you know and tuck it in with a cute belt cute boots or cute shoes or leggings I, I mean it's versatile i could do so much with this i could even tuck it in on a sunday for church tuck it in my skirt i'm thinking a gray skirt a black skirt or a white skirt see it works and you know what this one it was also under $10. I'm going to tell you guys how much it was. The ticket, oh, oh, it was right here. So this one was $7.89. Not bad, all right? So I love it. And I needed something like this. It's not bad. It's just a few things. And then the third shirt, really, I didn't I didn't get much. I didn't go too crazy. Um, the other one that I got, this one was $5.99. So it was only like 6 bucks to get a regular shirt, literally. This was just a t-shirt, be kind, I loved it. I think it was cute, it was comfortable. Six bucks, easy, I could throw it on with some cute leggings, some shorts, or jeans. Perfect, and that's it guys, that's what I got today. That was my shopping. I did most shopping for like the dogs and Shaheen, but I love it, like I loved it. It was like, honestly, I don't always recommend shopping for like 
to unwind or for therapy but today that was almost like my shopping therapy for me and even if i didn't buy anything but the fact that i was able to go out drive get some fresh air you know um even at winter park i like did a lot of walking around and i didn't really purchase anything i just i got a christmas card literally that's all it was and um i didn't purchase nothing else i just hung out guys you have to embrace um being alone you have to embrace have being able to enjoy yourself even if it means not purchasing anything um but you know to embrace that time to really clear your mind and unwind it's so healthy and it's also part of uh self-care and like fine life living you know you want to have that time where you could think things through and then plan and clear your mind because life can get hectic life could get busy but when we take time to pause breathe and relax you kind of like could go back and center yourself and really then be fresh to conquer whatever it is that you have to face but if you don't pause to think and breathe you're gonna be too like it's gonna affect you basically um so yeah that's all for today thank you so much for watching i'm sorry my hair is a hot mess it's the end of the day but i love you guys so much you guys rock don't forget to subscribe and as we always say here stay well be blessed and continue to live the fine life peace